southbound 745. Uh, also with me today is Detective Rick Hahn from the Dewitt County Sheriff's Office and Inspector Tony Hosey, Illinois State Police Task Force 6. Uh, the purpose of uh, the video and audio recording today is to document an actual walkthrough of the scene uh, with a recall of the events as they happen uh, by Maurice. Uh, Maurice, do we have your consent to both audio and video and tape? Also present doing the videotaping is Special Agent Troy Phillips, the Illinois State Police. And once again, the date is September 5th, 2003, time 1.02 p.m. Did you make any plans of how what you need to do to be able to get the car safely out of here? Now, this is a very important part, getting ready to leave. Are you, are you somewhat nervous because you're afraid that the car could go in the water? Is that why you well, said I that? I'm nervous because I've parked on ramps many times before. They have a ramp in St. Louis off of Hall Street. Uh, it's a lot more steeper and a lot more bigger than this. And we have parked there plenty of times. And no incident like this has ever occurred that I know of. And the many times I've been there, no incident like this has occurred. So, you know, I wasn't nervous about anything. If I was, I wouldn't have parked here. Okay. Tell us what happened, Maurice. I proceeded to start the car up. I put the car in reverse. My foot was on a brake. I looked behind me to make sure that there weren't any cars behind me as I was as I was to bag out. I quickly stepped on the acceler accelerator with a lot of power. Did you say anything to the kid at that point? Uh, not that I remember, so. Okay. Go ahead. I had to accelerate it real hard. The car went back a couple of inches. And the wheels just started spinning. Okay, Maurice, I'd like to point out something real quick. You're standing on the same ramp today. You notice that the condition of the ramp is very dry, is it not? Yes, sir, it is. Is it slippery at all, Maurice? Show me about when you applied the brakes to the vehicle. Just tell me when to stop. Right there. Okay, right about here is where you applied the brakes to the vehicle. Were the brakes able to hold the vehicle? Were they able to stop it? So. Okay. But today was a totally different day from that day. That day was a cold day. It was misty. It had been raining prior to that a couple of days. And did you attempt to brake any? Yeah. I knew it wasn't on use of braking because the car was, it was going at, a, at an accelerated rate. Okay. Maurice, could you, could you demonstrate for me about how fast you think that vehicle was going? If you could maybe back up a few steps just to make sure we don't go in the water here. But could you walk or jog, whatever the case may be, at the same speed as what you think that vehicle was entering the water? I want you to be able to approximate it for me. Vehicles entering the water about that speed. Did that's why I was still on the accelerator the whole time. Did the vehicle enter the water about the same speed, or did it increase or decrease its speed? It increased its speed, and it's rolling freely. You said your foot is not on the brake, and you're not on the accelerator. Is that correct? Yes, sir. Okay. All right, Maurice, the vehicle's going into the water. What takes place inside the car? Do you automatically go for the window. Okay, do, you, do, you, do you yell anything to let, let, the, let Amanda or the kids know what's going on, or are they aware of what's going on? Do you, do you recall what was said? was aware of what was going on. Do you recall if Amanda said anything? She said the car was the car's going in the water. Exactly. And what are the kids doing, Maurice? Are they saying anything? Not that I recall, sir. So. Back up just a minute. You said you went for the window. Yes, sir. Can you, can you explain that to me? I went to roll down the window. Okay. Because I knew if the car was sub submerged, the chances of, uh, of me getting out the door to help get them out would have been slim. Okay. So I figured 
with that window rolled down, you know, I would have had a better chance to save the kids. Okay, so you rolled down. Are, are these power windows? Yes. Manual windows? Power windows? So you rolled down which window? The driver window so I can get out. Right. Rolled out the driver's window so you can get out. Right, so I can get out and get to the door. Okay. Maurice, did, were you able to lower the driver's window? Somewhat. And I remember at a point, um, the window wasn't working, so that's why I had to resort to trying to get the door open. Can you show me about how far you think the window rolled down? I would say one fourth. Can you show me with, your, with your hands how, how far? I would say something like that. Maurice, can you, can you explain the why the driver's window of the vehicle is up, in the up position? No, oh, sir. No, oh, sir, I can't. Is the car still moving forward yes, sir. as you open the door? Okay. What's Amanda doing at this point? I'm not sure, sir. How about I'm the not, kids? I'm not positive, sir. I was just trying to figure out the best way to deal with this situation as possible. You know, because like I said, I was, I was panicking. I was terrified. You know, and I was just using my instincts. And, uh... That's all I can concentrate on and think of at that time. It's the best way to try to get these kids out the water. Right. Back to safety. But primarily, you need to get, you're trying to get yourself out first. Right. Right. Okay. Inside. You know, if we all are inside. Okay. When you were working on the uh, the door, getting it open, about how deep was that water on on you? Was it was it up to your waist? I mean, you're standing here, you're facing the car, you're you're working on this door, trying to get it to come open. How deep, how deep of, of the water was it? Run, run, yeah. chest height. Uh-huh. Okay. Could you see the kids at that point? Yes, sir. Where were the kids at? Towards the back of the window. Was the car sitting level in the water? No, sir. No, sir. The, the, the yes. front was down and the back was up. Yes, sir. Maurice, what are the kids doing at this point? You're trying to get the door open. What are the kids doing? Trying to, uh... Get air as much possible, because the water was still rising. And where are they at? Are they in the back are they submerged or are they the are they uh, floating on top? Weren't they weren't submerged at this point. No. So their heads are above the water. Yes, sir. All three of them. No, sir. Who whose head wasn't above the water? Kylie. Kylie's. Yes, sir. Is she still in her seat? Nice. Of the kids. Uncle. Screaming to you, Maurice, or the. What are the kids doing? I didn't even see them look at me. You said you recall they were trying to get here. How do you. Explain what were they doing trying to get air? The back of the window? Uh, you know, as if they were standing on the seats. 